everyone my name is Ebube Ene Echimina welcome to yet another terrific episode of Sisters Talk Sisters Talk focuses on contentious issues or that affects our society and our immediate environment and particularly as it affects the woman and then we also look at it from the angle of the church community okay today I have wonderful amazing people with me in the studio and guess what we're going to be talking about smile however i'm going to introduce my guest by the time we come back from this break don't go anywhere stay with me i'll be right back <music> And um, smile simply means a facial expression showing emotion and also showing your front teeth. <laughs> it will express emotions like um, excitement, amusement, anxiety, happiness, and so on and so forth. Wow. So I think it just takes a feeling to smile because your smile speaks a lot about you. Like they say, action speaks louder than words. Okay. Your smile is an action that tells us how you feel, or how you're feeling at that instant, okay. at that moment. Um, I think smiling really doesn't take much from you. Just moving little muscles in your face. But the benefits of smiling are immense. There are a lot of benefits with little or no disadvantages. Is there any kind of smile we should smile and then somebody will say, I just don't like the way that guy is smiling. <laughs> <laughs> Pastor Fred, what do you think? Well, um, I understand we have 19 different kinds of smile, but um, because of our time, this 19 type of smile has just been classified into two main categories, okay. talking about fake smile and genuine smile. Then if you can you talk about the fake smile? I'm interested <laughs> in that. I mean, aren't you curious? The fake smile, somebody can be looking at you with this smile and telling himself, see her head. <laughs> <laughs> or what I would do to her. <laughs> oh my God! If you want to call it a fake smile, it's, it's still a smile anyway. But yeah. fake in the sense that your emotions are not what you're trying to portray. You're trying to say, "I'm smiling, I'm happy with you," but actually, you're not happy with the person, or you're happy that something bad has happened to that person. That can be looked at as a fake smile. Do you think our thought has to do with? Smiling, yes. Oh, then you okay. Let me quote a scripture on that one in Proverbs chapter 27, verse 19. It says that just like water mirrors a face, if you look into, let's say, a river now, you look down, you see your face, your reflection. So, also, the face mirrors the heart. Okay. So, whatever you're thinking usually comes out in your face. Anytime as a child of God, whenever you're smiling, it means you're making the devil or your enemies to frown. Okay. So anytime you frown, you're giving the devil or your enemies the chance to smile. But may I not be the one frowning. I'd rather be the one smiling for my enemies to frown. <laughs> <laughs> wow. The things we think about, they are very, very, very important to the, our outlook, especially in the morning. Because you find that it affects everybody you meet on the way. So what are we actually talking about here? We are saying that your thoughts can make you smile or it can make you also to frown as well. We are going to be taking a break. Stay with us. We'll be right back. <music> Let me come from the occupational aspect of it. Okay. I think smiling is important for your work. Okay. If you're dealing with customers. Smiling also has a lot to do with your aging process. Wow. That's why it has been scientifically proven that those that frown a lot get older faster than those that smile. Uh, because, what are we waiting for? Because because <laughs> smile. Customer care lines. If you call them, they are trained. Those receiving the calls, they are trained to smile even while answering calls because they believe that the smiles can be heard. And when you are smiling and you're speaking to someone on the phone, you sound more helpful, you sound more pleasant. 
to the person listening. So occupationally, it helps you. Smiling helps you build a good self-esteem. If you walk into a place and you're smiling, it also has a way of creating attention and enhancing your attraction. It helps you get better ideas, inspirations, you know, to do it better. Even to, to listen excellent. to instruction if, instruction, you corrected, yeah, if you are corrected and you are smiling. This is quite interesting. Are you getting anything from this? Imagine when you smile, you live longer. When you smile, you look younger. When you smile, in fact, you follow that even in your workplace, people can hear your smile. When you smile, it takes nothing for you. You are healthier. You know, there's so many things attached to this word we are talking about. Smile. So where you are in your living room, maybe you should give yourself a smile. You will feel better. Are you feeling pain about something? Give yourself a smile. The benefits of a smile cannot be overemphasized. <music> quite an enlightening moment you know talking about this smile smiling okay so please make sure you are wearing a smile as you are watching us right now okay and then uh, my name is Ibe Ene Ichimina if you want to contact us and you want to talk to us you want us to hear your contributions or there's some things you feel okay I want to tell them about this or that we would love to get your constructive criticism okay so you can just follow us on our uh, grace tv page you know and of course we will we'll give attention to you, whatever you have to say and then for sponsorship details please contact us we would love to hear from you okay so 